I've been getting a lot of questions and comments about my kayak setup on the RV. So I'm gonna show you around and show you what I did. Most people put their kayaks on a little hitch on the back of the RV, but since we got this big boy back here, we couldn't do that, so we had to figure something else out. So really our only option was to put it up top. First of all, to get up there, you're gonna need a ladder. Got this ladder off of Amazon. It's real easy to store away. Pop it up, it's called a telescoping ladder. Boom. Let me go show you how we got it situated up there. What we did was install these little D-rings into the edge of the RV where this big metal strip is on the side. So we have four of them situated all around here. We have this one and this strap goes over to that side. It anchors the kayak from kind of going back and forth. And there's another strap running back to here. And then a little one that goes over top of there. So on all there's three straps holding it down. And uh, this thing ain't going anywhere. All right, the way I installed these D hooks was I installed it into this metal stripping on the side so it would be real secure. First, you would, you pick off all this uh, sealant stuff. And you drill a hole, get some silicone, and you fill up that hole and you fill all the bottom of this, this metal piece right here so that it won't leak. And then you screw the screw down in there. And then once you're done, you get some die core or some sort of roof sealant and you put it all over the top. And that's what all that white stuff is over top of there. So you don't have any leaks. We also have pool noodles, um, just so it's not beating against the roof of Thoretta. Um, give it a little bit of cushion in between. And to get it down, just take off these straps here. And these specific straps, we cut them to the right length so that there's not a lot of excess flapping around when we're driving. Leave the straps up here hooked up so that it's easier to put it back up here when you get it. Everything's all in place. Now we're gonna take it down. It's over. Put it right here. I'm gonna send it down to Katie. Grab the pool noodles. Cause they will blow away. <clears throat> yeah. Stick them in the kayak. Save them for later. And that is how you get the kayak down <laughs> from up on the roof. After you have your fun little adventure and you want to put the kayak back, we're going to lift it up flat against the, against the RV. Get all your pool noodles situated. You start strapping her down. So on this strap, I didn't want to put a hook straight into the top of this roof because there wasn't anything real secure to hold it down. So I had to put it all the way over there. So in order to stop it from going back and forth, I take this. Do a little loop. 
doopity doo. Around the nose of the kayak. Get it nice and secure. It kind of catches right here on this little piece down here. It's nice and secure. here make sure it doesn't move around make sure it's steady down there she's not going anywhere all right that's how you do it that's how you put your kayak on your roof we're good to go 100 miles an hour down the highway let's go <laughs> <laughs> okay